This is the examiner's favorite. Every IGCSE chemistry exam must have a question about ionic bonds. And here's the best way to understand it. The atom on the left is unstable because it has one valence electron. So the sodium atom here must lose that outer shell electron. Fluorine on the right is desperate to get that electron and get the noble gas electron configuration. All atoms at the periodic table can become stable if they get the full outer shell of a noble gas. In this case, sodium would become stable because now it has a valence electrons and so is fluorine. The attraction we get here between the positive ions and the negative ions is what we call an ionic bond. During the formation of an ionic bond, a large set of ions get involved to form a cluster of ions that alternate with their charge. This is known as an ionic lattice. Strong electrostatic force of attraction exists between those ions and that caused the ionic lattice to have very high melting points.